Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Jonathan Gardner. In this video, we are going to install the X edit, this TS5 edit, SSE edit, blah, 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 for uh, Skyrim Special Edition. And we're following the begin to wiki page from the Reddit Skyrim mods. And we go over here to the SSE edit download page at Skyrim mods at the Nexus. And read it, it's a ESP viewer and conflict detector when started, it'll automatically find your Skyrim data folder. You then get a dialog select like which master's plugins you want to load with the current selection for your plugins. Once you've confirmed the dialog selection, the plugins will start loading. The only thing you need is 7-zip. And let's see, permissions and credits. It says, author's instructions. The contents of this file are subject to the Mozilla Public License version 1.1. You may not use this file except in compliance with the license. Software distributed is, okay, no warranty. File credits, Bethesda for their awesome program and Elminster AU. Thank you, Elminster AU. You're awesome. All right, this mod is opted in to receive donation points. I'm not gonna do that. Here's some mirrors you can download it from GitHub if you want. Okay, so we go to the files tab, we download this file, we get this file down here. It's, uh, let's see if we can find one. Where did it go? Where did it go? It's up here, here we go. This is SSE edit 4.0. We're gonna open that 7-zip open archive and it creates this little file here. And we're going to extract it to a friendly little folder. So I'm gonna go into games, I'm gonna make a new folder called xedit, X edit. The reason why it's called xedit, because if you're running other versions of the game, or if you're playing like, you know, Fallout or something like that, then you just rename that file and it will run for that. So we have SSE edit and SSE edit 64. Okay, let's close this. And now let's add it to our mod organizer. So we're gonna go here to this tab, edit. And then we look for the binary. And we go up here to games, xedit, SSE edit 64, click open. We're gonna call this SSE edit 64. And I don't think we need anything special there. Let's add that. It's closed. And now we can run SSE edit 64. This is what it looks like. You have started the 64 bit version is if you are getting an out of memory error while using 30 bit and uses less memory. Are you sure you want to continue? No, I'm not. Let's use the 32 bit version. So let's edit. Let's add the 32-bit version of SSE edit. And let's call it SSE edit 32. Okay, let's add that. Let's run the 32-bit version, see what happens. It says, what's new in Xedit? It tells you all the new stuff. This is awesome. Awesome, please read. Hello, I'm Elminster AU, the original developer of Xedit. Some years ago when I became clear to me that with work commitments and the birth of our twins that I would not have time to adequately maintain, I decided to open source the program. Thank the group of dedicated people to the job foremost, HLP, HIP, I guess, Zylev, Charlecran, and Shesan with contributions from a number of others. They have done fantastic work and created for all of it. It's truly amazing to see a small tool that I built for myself over a decade ago evolve into the full-blown editor it is today. Uh, recently found some spare time, uh, issue tracker, it took extra time for my full-time job. This progress is only possible. The reason most of my time you just spent on paid work to exit. Hence, I have started a Patreon campaign. It's freely available, but the amount of times will depend on your support. I hope you can. Th thank you, Vance, for your support. Okay, so he's ac asking for money through Patreon. Okay, there we go. I don't know. I haven't used this tool very much, but it does some things that are important. Thank you for telling me about Patreon. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and I don't want tips. Anyway, this is this tool. We're not using it for anything. We just wanted to install it for other things. I'm gonna close out of that early. There we go. All right, that's how you do SSE edit. Everybody, thanks for watching. We'll continue next time. Take care and bye-bye.